So, Teo Fella, we're here to recreate the goal you scored for Peru against Scotland in the 1978 World Cup. Straight for the shot. But I have already recreated this goal. Have you? When was that? About four minutes later. Kubiat. The ball flipped through and it's a goal. Oh, well, okay then. Thanks very much. Nice to meet you. Frank, Teofilo, we've done a lot of preparation for this. We've got the rest of the Peru team already warming up. <laughs> anyway, it was a very difficult game for us because Scotland were so popular, as their manager, Ali McLeod, said. Well, everyone supports Scotland. Everyone? What, Acker Bilk? Did he support Scotland? <laughs> Or uh, the Baron Knights, eh? <laughs> Were they on the march with Ali's army? <laughs> yeah, or Leslie Jodd. Leslie Jodd! <laughs> oh, wouldn't it be marvellous if Scotland became the 1978 World Cup victors? I hope they do. <laughs> oh, Leslie Jodd has left us with egg on our faces. <laughs> what, what has Scotland got that made them so special? I don't know, but it certainly was not their World Cup song. Ole ole, ole ole. We are going to bring that World Cup back from over there. <laughs> what kind of rhyme is that? Of course, this was the game in which Scottish winger Willie Johnston was tested positive for drugs. Oh, that was outrageous. Even Jock Steen said there was no real proof. I haven't seen Willie Johnston going up the lane. <laughs> no, no, no. The BBC panel talked about it as if it was some terrible crime. Well, you know, they are people who live very clean, respectable lives. We hear from Cordoba <laughs> at a press conference that Willie Johnson has admitted taking two stimulating drugs before Scotland's World Cup match against Peru last Saturday. OK, then, let's do the goal. Quaito. Kubiat. Straight for the shot. Kubiat, straight for the shot. Oh. He put that away so well. You know, I remember Ali McLeod saying that Scotland were going to win the World Cup. <laughs> Is that the most stupid thing that anybody's ever said? No, I heard people say more stupid things than that. I must say, when you look like an ace's uh, background, when he was uh, transferred from West Bromwich to Leeds, they discovered he got a hole in the heart. Ever since he had that news, he seems to become a harder worker than ever. He really is a player who powers his way through a match. A real driver, a real worker, a genuine old-hearted player. 